Today, I am pleased to announce that we have secured a historic resolution of our pending claims against BP totaling more than $20 billion, making it the largest settlement with a single entity in American history. The resolution includes civil claims under the Clean Water Act, for which BP has agreed to pay a $5.5 billion penalty, the largest civil penalty in the history of environmental law. It includes natural resources damages claims under the Oil Pollution Act, for which BP has agreed to pay $7.1 billion, on top of the $1 billion it had previously committed to pay for early restoration work. And it includes economic damages claims, for which BP has agreed to pay $4.9 billion to the five Gulf states and up to $1 billion to local governments working with all the federal agencies and our state counterparts to, to uh, bring together this. Uh Taken as a whole, this resolution is both strong and fitting. BP is receiving the punishment it deserves, while also providing critical compensation for the injuries that it caused to the environment and the economy of the Gulf region. The steep penalty should inspire BP and its peers to take every measure necessary to ensure that nothing like this can ever happen again. Talked a lot about how much is being done. What? Well, the settlement is not not um, not designed to discourage uh, any valid economic activity in the Gulf, and certainly the oil production that takes place there is also a val valid and valued part of the American economy. What it is designed to do, however, is to not only compensate for the damages and provide for a way forward for the health and safety of the Gulf, but let other companies know that they are going to be responsible for the harm that incurs should, should uh, accidents like this happen in the future.